Good afternoon, this is Todd Horowitz, coming to you from the floor of the CME Group in Chicago. And of course, we've been following the Ultra Bond and, and uh, looked for uh, some selling off. But of course, we're seeing a period now of extreme fear. And, and the problem with this extreme fear is it's continuing to push the Ultra Bond much higher. I, I think when you look at the bigger picture, it's basically going up in a parabolic range. So we are wrong initially, and I guess we're, we're not going to exactly try to fight it. You cannot fight the markets, but what we are seeing is, you know, what is the deal with the overall rate hikes here? And, and, and that is what we, I think we're seeing here is when you, when you look at the markets, the Fed is calling for rate hikes, but yet the fixed income traders are really slamming down the door as they push the ultra bond or regular bond prices higher, bringing interest rates lower. We're seeing this overall battle here, and I think you're seeing the, the, the fixed income flex, we'll call it, where the traders are really kind of flexing their muscles. As, as we look back and go back in time, when the Fed was not willing to raise rates, we believe that the fixed income traders, being the biggest market in the world, would be able to maneuver once the Fed ran out of bullets, which is exactly what they did. They got the Fed on the, the, the hike raise, but now you're seeing that these bonds continue to push higher and they're really going at leaps and bounds. This has all the makings of more of a short squeeze, which is what we thought when we looked for the rally. I think here you have to wait and watch for this rally to slow down. You have to wait for the shorter term market and looking at a chart, the shorter term to go sideways or start to come in before actually getting short here. I don't think you'd want to be a buyer of bonds. I think it's very evident that rates are going to rise. I think it's very evident that this overall move is based on fear. But at the end of the day, you really can't stop in front of it until it starts to slow down. So we're going to watch, of course, we're going to watch the 164 level. We're going to watch the 165. But we do need to see some sort of a pullback before we can actually decide to be back and participate. But based on what the, the bonds are saying, the ultra bond, we're saying that rates aren't going to rise. The Fed says they are. Let's see who wins that battle. This is Todd Horowitz coming to you from the floor of the Steamer Group in Chicago.